All right, what's going on, guys? What can you be in today? I'm here with Cameron, of course, because uh, his setup's uh, yeah. in my room. So today we're going to be doing a room tour. I haven't done one of these uh, since quarantine. Uh, and that was a pretty, pretty long time ago. So we're doing one in summer of 2021. So uh, if you guys didn't want this video, too bad, because I'm at loss for content. So All right, so starting off with this little corner area, we have my dresser, which uh, has my TV on it. Um, I can show my chat on here if I'm uh, live streaming or anything, but yeah, TV, uh, it's like 55 inches, don't ask me, I don't know. We have the remote for it, of course, and then we have my dresser, and the first drawer, we have my extra shaker cups, which I do use for G Fuel. Um, we have the Dumb Element Shaker, uh, Shock sh Shaker, um, we have uh, Charlotte Hornets one, uh, Sonic, uh, the Hive Season, uh, Blackout, the Pink Drip, and then we have the uh, Barbecue, that's what that's called, uh, the Resident Evil Village, uh, Mortal Kombat 11, uh, what's this one called, Winter Mint, uh, we have the Phase Miami right here, the Birthday Shaker, uh, the Phase X, um, the, uh, what's this one called? The drip, phase drip, I think. I don't know, I forgot. Then we have the other Hive Season uh, Tall Boy Shaker. So yeah, those are the ones that I drink out of. That's not my shaker collection. These are just the ones that I drink out of. And then the rest of the two drawers just have like my clothes in it, which nobody cares about. Then we have over here, we have my shoe collection. Uh, we have the Off-White, uh, Travis One Highs. Those are the highs. Um, the Travis Lows. And then a pair of Kobe's and just a lot of other basketball shoes. Okay, so walking over here, we have my like beverage thing where we get all of our drinks from. And uh, in this uh, drawer, we have, these are all extra cubs, by the way. These are all the extra ones that aren't on my tower over there. Um, so we have Mystery, uh, Hive Nectar, Maiden's Blood. Over here, we got the uh, Yuzu Hydration. Boysenberry, um, Peach Cobbler, my open tub. Uh, we have Peach Iced Tea, Lemonade, Scorpion Sting, um, Peach Rings, uh, Seal Tub of Peach Iced Tea, Phase X, uh, Seal Tub Peach Cobbler, um, what's this one called? Again, Wava Fruit, that's what that's called, my bad guys. Uh, Ice Coffee, Classified, Phase X, um, and then we have Hype Sauce, and then in this drawer, we have some extra boxed stuff. So pretty much we have a sealed birthday shaker. Um, cause I, I obviously have an extra one. And then we have a sealed doodle, uh, shaker. And then we have, uh, my extra hive nectar collector's box and my extra maiden's blood, uh, collector's box. Moving over to my mini fridge. Don't ask me what mini fridge this is. Um, all I know is it's an insignia. Um, so right here on the top, we got, uh, shakers that are dirty. Of course, I only have one that's dirty right now, an extra winter white. Um, my LED remotes for my LED strips. We have, uh, one right here and we have one right there. That one's always pink. That one's always blue. So, um, we have a water bottle, which I really don't need anymore. Uh, camera uses it uh, as a phone prop up for his videos usually. Um, and then the freezer, we have a bunch of ice cubes for G Fuel. Um, ice cube trays in the back there are some ice like bigger cubes um, and Then opening the main portion of the fridge we do drink a lot of G fuel. Of course, that's what my channel is um, But like sometimes we just want other stuff than G fuel um, So we have water for G fuel or just for drinking water. Uh, we have Arizona always on the top um, I had buy way too much Arizona and then we have uh, coke uh, right over there not the drug the drink and over here we have a table that me and Cameron John Cena whenever we get mad. John Cena! So, uh, and of course there's Cameron. So we have his setup over here in the corner. He has uh, my old office chair, which is way more comfortable than my gaming chair right now. And of course we have Cameron. Oh, and then right here we have his desk, which is pretty dusty right now, but we'll, we'll fix that. We'll fix that or that no those are just all fingerprints from him just smashing his fist on there all the time um so over in the corner he has his uh g fuel collection so uh give us a little tour of your g fuel collection i have classified aka the um new free guy i got shiny splash like one scoop of pipe sauce and lump of fruit then the collector's boxes he has some of my extra ones like uh sonics and the phase x one and then he has a samsung monitor and it's 
uh, PS4 again. Oh, excuse I me, guys. Right there, we have my old sticker thing, those holes in the wall. We are, I'm going to get some spackling and I'll fix that real soon. And then we have, of course, my setup, which is, of course, you guys see it in the streams. Uh, you've seen it in my old uh, room tour, but there's some stuff I haven't showed you and there's, uh, of course, some new stuff. Hopping over here, we have, of course, the elephant. In the setup, we have the pink GT Racing uh, gaming chair. I called it a GTR racing chair. It's not a GTR racing chair, I'm an idiot. It's actually a GT racing chair. Um, all pink, um, because my whole, like, thing has been pink. Moving on to the desk, um, I have a laptop over here, which, of course, I have the HDMI run to my, uh, this other monitor, uh, that shows my chat when I'm streaming, and then, um, I have this monitor, which, of course, shows my game from my PS5, um, but we have the, uh, SteelSeries Apex 100. I have a good keyboard and mouse just because I do plan on buying uh, my cousin's gaming PC. Um, do I need it? No, but uh, for editing use and for you know playing some games that you can't get on the PlayStation, um, I think I do need it. So that's, I'm gonna get a gaming PC. There's the uh, Apex 100 by SteelSeries. Uh, really, really nice sounding uh, keyboard. They're also pretty, pretty cheap as well. So you guys can go get those. Then we have a Razer uh, Viper Mini mouse. Um, it's, it's really, really good for the price and just for what it is. Of course, a mouse. I think I only paid like 40 bucks for it. And then we got my Razer Siren Mini, I believe this mic is called. Um, that's my stream mic and that's what I used to play games, of course. And then my headset hasn't changed. It's still the, uh, PlayStation, uh, Pulse 3D headset. Um, I really, really enjoy this. Only complaint I have about this is if you're planning on playing games for a while, uh, or it's like watching movies and stuff. This headset probably isn't the best for you because it can get a little bit uncomfortable after a while Of course, we have uh, my controller uh, My airpods which are usually always on my desk and my glasses Which I usually only use while playing games and driving in the dark the gorgeous G fuel mouse pad um, And the coaster set like I said in the last room tour the website I got these from sadly shut down or I would of course put a link in my bio of where you guys and go get this but it's you can't get it anymore then we have this little extra drawer which has a bunch of junk in there i don't really want to show you guys because i'll be embarrassed and then down here we have my cable management which is kind of cheeks but it's it's all right for what it is it doesn't get in my way um i do plan on getting uh surge protectors just like lined up there and mounting them on the back uh so that you know of course all my stuff can be protected and it just looks better right there we have more cables leading up to my big triangle light and then i have a, another extension cord running all the way to those lights right there but i'll show you guys those in a second uh surge protectors um right there on the wall um like i said i would really really even though you know it's not likely that your stuff will of course you know be broken because of a power surge i really do recommend you guys get one uh, because, of course, I have uh, all this expensive, expensive equipment. I really don't want it getting broken because of lightning. Just imagine. So I forgot to show you guys my monitors. These are on 32-inch monitors, I believe. Um, they're a really, really good monitor for the value. Uh, they look really, really sharp in my setup. So I, I really, really like them like a lot. So yeah, they're my monitors. Uh, they take up pretty much my whole desk. And this desk is pretty big, and uh, I kind of refuse to get a new desk, even though it's a little bit chipped in these areas, just because I've had this desk since I first started YouTube, like 10 years ago. So, uh, yeah, I really don't want to give up this desk. And also, it's a really, really, really solid desk, uh, because you guys know I do tend to rage a lot. Oh my god. Why, Why do I put myself in this mental drama? So, I do slam my fist on this. Uh, or if it goes John Cena at the table, but uh, yeah, I slam my fist on this most of the time. So uh, I want a sturdy desk, and this is a perfect desk, and it's just perfect for what I need. Moving over to the G Fuel collection. Um, so I'll actually just show you guys row by row what I have. Um, most of these are sealed, because I do buy pretty much two of every tub you can get. So most of these are sealed, some of these aren't. Um, of course, right there... I'll just give you guys a little swoop. You guys can see what I got. Um, Cause I really don't feel like naming off all the flavors, but yeah, I've done videos on literally all these flavors. You guys can go watch all of them. Actually not all of these. Um, some of them I have missed. Um, 
but yeah so there's the bottom row i'll actually move this so you guys can see and speaking of this um this is a pretty pretty rare gamestop exclusive uh uh purple skull trooper funko pot which i didn't think was rare but i looked on ebay and this is going for 100 bucks so i have it in this protective case and i do play fortnite a lot on my streams as you guys know so of course he's a, just a really really cool background character um and then right here we have the uh doom spicy demonade uh bfg tub um these little light things from walmart and then right there i have my little triangle light thing that i use for lighting along with that so yeah i use that for lighting and i use that for lighting uh this is also doubles as a tripod and a phone stand for when i record my videos moving down here i have this cube organizer so one it doubles as holding all my g fuel tubs and it also doubles as holding my collector's boxes and my shakers um so yeah uh taking a look at this first cube slot we got this led light that's fading rapidly um it's holding out for dear life uh right here we have the hive nectar sh uh collector's box and most of these i do have the shaker still in them uh because i buy like doubles of all my collector's boxes um so the hive nectar uh this one does have the shaker still in it um as i have the one that doesn't have the shaker in the other one and then we have the resident evil village collector's box the maiden's blood collector's box um and then we have the bobby boysenberry collector's box um and then we have the phase drip uh the extra one i also buy pretty much doubles of all my shakers um, and then we have the clickbait collector's box. Of course, the shaker's still on there. We have the Mortal Kombat 11 uh, Scorpion Sting collector's box right there. And then we have the Hive Season shaker, uh, the double. And then we have the Tetris Blast collector's box. And then down here, um, we have the Sonic collector's box, uh, the Pink Trick collector's box, um, the Smile More shaker. The tall boy and then we have the phase x uh collector's box and the uh dub millimeter collector's box and then moving over here we have some of my favorite shakers and mo some of my most rare shakers uh we have the shock shaker i never used um in this plastic case because this is going for like 170 dollars right now which is kind of surprising but also shock is dope so i do kind of get that so the one shock shaker i haven't used my double is of course um uh, over there and we have the pewdiepie uh shaker this one was my first shaker i've ever purchased then we have the uh rainbow roman right there which is also getting pretty rare then we have some tall boys we got uh the aquamarine uh the diamond and the master ball uh and then right here we have some of my extra shakers uh right here actually this is some of my shaker collection uh we got the doc which doc is not with the company of course anymore then we have the PewDiePie 100 milli, uh, another barbecue. Uh, we got the Hornets again, uh, Phase Miami, and this PewDiePie one, which I forgot what it's called. Uh, I don't know what it's called. Sorry, guys. All right, so thank you guys so much for watching this video, um, and thank you guys so much for all the new people that have subbed to the channel and all the people who, of course, enjoy my live streams. I really, really do appreciate it. And uh, yep, I will see you guys in the next video.